Hello XDC family and welcome back to Crypto Already. If you want to be ready for crypto, then you are in the right place. Today I have got many explosive updates for the XDC community. The EU Parliament has approved MICA regulations for crypto. The UK and Oklahoma have signed a trade deal. The demand for gold is at all time high and Russia is getting ready to adopt crypto for trade. So guys, I hope you will watch to the end as today's video will be explosive and fire as usual. So getting on straight to the main information for today, guys, because I can't wait to share this with you. Looking at a tweet from XTC Foundation, Vantage Point, a blueprint for digital negotiable instrument in light of MICA. Today, the EU Parliament advanced legislation for MICA bringing regulatory clarity to the European crypto asset industry that does not exist in countries like the USA. Recently, Andre Kostman outlined his blueprints for the DNI initiative and how they can benefit the global trade industry. Today's ruling, Mika can offer the DNI initiative an attractive extension through the use of on-chain settlement on the basis of regulated stablecoins. And as blockchain technology such as the XTC network becomes well established as a viable solution that works with legacy systems and not against them, we can advance the landscape in global trade and create an inclusive Web3 economy. So guys, I'm going to have a quick look at the article because it's got some huge and key points that you need to listen to. Because finally, guys, what we've been talking about for the last few months, regulations are finally here. The EU area has triggered off that domino effect and there is going to be a unified crypto regulatory framework coming up all across the globe. And here, guys, before we talk about Mika, look at this, the blueprint for digital negotiable instruments. And as you can see, DNI is bringing the required policy and technology. And you've got the involvement of ITFA, DDoC specifications and the United Nations and the UK is leading the MLETR adoption, which is going to happen in June this year. So as you can see, guys, Mika coming in from Europe now, it's all going to bring this together, guys. Even yesterday, you heard us talk about the huge developments that the XDC community, the XDC team in Europe were making. They wanted to launch an office in Berlin. Now, guys, it's all coming together. It's definitely going to be a huge year for XDC and crypto with utility. And just listen to this quote, guys, from Andre Kosterman. DLT is a 21st century innovation that needs to be embraced with a 21st century open banking mindset. That's where most trade focused consortia have failed so far, not only the bankrupt ones. So guys, you can tell by this that everything is getting aligned to the 21st century. Like I said to you guys before, most of the people in the world, like billions of them, don't have access to banking, right? We have to fly paper across the world. These are not 21st century technologies. They are well behind guys and they are ready to align it and bring it all on the blockchain and XTC guys as you can see, is going to fit in and solve all these problems. So the main provisions will be enacted for Mika just over 12 months after publication in the EU's official journal, likely in June of 2023. So guys, we have potentially got MLETR going live in June. We've got Mika coming in June. Wow, it's going to be a huge 2023, guys. And it says here, guys, that the Mika legislation means that the EU will have a unified approach to crypto asset regulation across all 27 member states, making it possible for firms approved in one country to passport their business into others with minimal additional paperwork. And Mika offers the DNI initiative, an attractive extension through the use of on-chain settlement on the basis of regulated stablecoins, for instance. So guys, as you can see, this is where DNI, TFDI, all the big boys come in. All right, and XDC is at the heart of this transformation because XDC blockchain is the only blockchain part of this trillion dollar initiative. And to finish off with this article here, guys, it says here that as blockchain technology becomes well established as a viable solution that works with legacy systems and not against them, further progress will be achieved. And even now, guys, so far in the first four months of this year, we've achieved so much. Mick has come in, MLETI is coming in, what else is there left, guys? We need regulation so we can see which crypto assets will survive. And now I can tell you clearly, guys, that utility will win the day. I hope you are paying attention, guys, because if you're holding meme coins, 
I don't think you have a long-term chance. You need to invest in utility like XDC to survive the downfall that we could potentially see because we are still waiting for that massive crash, guys. And if you wanna make it through the other side of the tunnel, once everything is done, then you need to invest carefully and responsibly into utility because regulations are here guys so please pay attention let's move on to the next bit looking at tweet from trade finance global the uk and oklahoma sign a trade deal furthering international cooperation now guys i don't need to open this article because this is just the beginning the uk is gonna be cooperating with many more countries this is just the beginning because everybody knows they work with english law and they are going to start to use mletr after june and many countries have already lined up using mledr already and it's gonna have a domino effect guys and just remember how much value and demand it's gonna bring for the xdc network because we are the only blockchain part of this initiative and uk is working closely icc all the big boys are hugely engaged into making this a reality guys so i hope you're paying attention let's move on to the next bit looking at tweet from watch your guru just in russia prepares draft law to allow use of crypto for international trade settlements now what do you think that means guys countries are getting ready to allow the use of crypto for payments and for trade settlements do you really think it's a coincidence that russia is getting ready to allow crypto payments and crypto trade settlements and mikas come in and we've got mletr coming in potentially the ripple versus scc lawsuit is going to settle as well around this time so guys what do you reckon it is a planned and coordinated event, guys. Everything's happening because it's been planned well in advance. Do you really think they don't know who the creator of Bitcoin is? Of course they do. Why would they be preaching and marketing Bitcoin if they didn't know who it was? So guys, they know everything. They know the perfect timing for everything. All you have to do is get your ducks in a row, buy utility crypto like XTC, keep it offline as much as possible and have diamond hands, guys, because our time is here because regulations are here guys so please be ready let's move on to the next bit looking at tweet from gold telegraph the russian central bank governor says russia is building up its international reserves with assets that west can't sanction currently there is a rush to gold from central banks all over the world sadly many generalists will be the last to catch on guys i don't want you to miss the boat all right i always preach investing in utility cryptos but also in gold and silver because gold has been the perfect hedge for hundreds of years so i honestly want to recommend investing in gold as well i'm going to leave a link at the top of my description for kinesis exchange where you get free silver for using my link and then when you buy gold or silver you get rewarded every single month and they even have a card which allows you to spend your gold and silver what more could you need guys this is the new and easy way guys to invest in gold and silver by just pressing a few buttons and if you ever wanted it in the physical form you can get that too guys so this is the future guys gold is here to stay gold is going to be coming back in a digital way the gold standard is due to come back guys i do think that the usa has an ace up their sleeves they're going to come in and they're going to get lined up with regulations and they're going to be bringing back the gold standard and a basket of currencies all around the world with the BRICS nations coming in guys it's all coming together it's a very exciting time guys to be alive at this time if you can make the most of it because right now everything is in front of you right if you can see it because a lot of people now the masses cannot see what is happening they are so stuck in the agendas they cannot see the potential opportunity here for making generational wealth so if you're here if you're new to this channel make sure you hit that subscribe button because i only give utility talk and i will try my best to guide you to generational wealth so guys diamond hands and patience will win the day so that is it for today guys if you enjoyed the video you know what to do please hit that subscribe button please like this video and share this video with family and friends and let them know that crypto ready is the place for them to be if they want to be ready for crypto i shall see you on another video tomorrow take care